Hello everybody, I'm Neon Icy Wings, and we are completing our journey in Final Fantasy XV, Episode Ignis. I was contemplating if I should do the, uh, Assassin's DLC, and I decided not to. I'm just gonna do it on my own, because it's just like, the Chocobo Festival wasn't that stimulating. So it's like, eh. But, we're just gonna go, get right down to it, and play Episode Ignis, and see if it is, uh any good if it's pretty good also i uh played the update which has the um uh ability to swap between the characters so i already kind of know what ignis is going to play like uh, i think and i'm actually kind of shocked that they actually put in the uh character the ability to play as the characters themselves and uh have the gameplay be the episode gameplay i still don't know if prompto is uh, able to regenerate ammo or anything, but just, uh, just so you know, I do know that there are multiple endings to this. Not sure if I will specifically go out of my way to get a good ending or the best ending, alternate ending or whatever, but, uh, out of all of them, all the episodes, this one seems the most interesting because, and it's happening exactly where I knew it was. When Ignis, just before he got his eyes attacked and blinded. And, of course, this is going to be the most story important, which kind of makes me go again, like, why wasn't this in the main game? Why wasn't these side missions a part of the main game? Like, oh, here's a section where he plays Gladio. Here's another section where he plays Prompto, invading a base. Here's a, a miscellaneous action moments where he plays Ignis. And then all of these could be the final uh, missions of their respective things. Also, I find it funny that it's all over the place. Like, Gladios is the first in the timeline to happen, and that was released first. Then Promptos is the last to happen in the timeline, but that's second. And then this one's the uh, second in the timeline, yet this is released uh, third. Also, wonderful music here. But, uh, well, let's just get on to it. Oh, and I guess, uh, I might as well say, so like, just from these, I'm not sure if I will continue playing Final Fantasy XV beyond this. Having expended all his energy in the fight with the Leviathan, Noctis, collapse, uh, Noctis collapses upon the al altar of the Tide Mother. Though their conflict has ended, the battle between the gods and Imperial forces rage on. Fearing for his friend's safety and mid the chaos of war, Ignis races through the ruined streets of Altissia to rescue the fallen prince. That really needs, like, a, a, a boldening or, like, a stroke around it to, just to highlight the words beyond the background. But, uh, I'm not sure if I will play any more uh, Final Fantasy XV. Like, I'll probably go finish up whatever trophies I'm missing to get a tr platinum... But beyond that, I'm not going to plat like even if there was a platinum, I don't think I'd platinum the uh, side episodes because honestly, the achievements are kind of shit. I'm looking at you, Prompto. Your time trials are terrible. Also, I am very happy that I didn't try out the time attack on Prompto's episode because that is shit. But uh, beyond that, I don't think I'm I'm gonna get any more DLC for this because of course a season pass is for a season of DLC releases and they're gonna be like oh but we're gonna have so much more content it's just like your extra content isn't that good to me like it, it's this is an RPG it's supposed to be sit down play for a long long time and the episodes aren't that their missions cut out of a main game in my opinion which of course is completely false because they were made after the game was finished quote unquote i say quote unquote especially for because all these episodes were tied into the main stories like oh this and that burr, burr, burr. but man just like put them in the main game especially considering you can now play as them normally anyway so meh. listen well a king cannot lead by standing still. A king pushes onward always, accepting the consequences and never looking back. That said, 
A king can accept nothing without first accepting himself. Should he stand still, I ask you to stand by him and lend him a hand, as his friend and as his brother. Yeah, for a moment I thought we were obnoxious, Please, but no. Take care of my son. This really shows kind of the relationship, I guess, between Noctis and Ignis. I assume it's Ignis. It'd be weird to be anything else. I'm afraid. <laughs> I'm sorry, that cutoff. I must ask your forgiveness. That cutoff was just hilarious to me. Reuse cutscenes! And uh, reuse of that awesome music. And one of the best boss battles in this game. Seriously, if this was a part of the main story, it would be freaking awesome. Knocked. Do you read me? Do you know if he's okay? The trial should be over by now, right? Can't tell a bloody thing from here. Let's make for the altar. Knock out this sea bitch, Titan. Look out! Like, honestly, that is movie quality look to me. Final Fantasy 15, Episode Ignis. Also known as the one that, out of all of them, should have been in the main game the most. Chapters? Hmm. They, uh, this just keeps getting... Each of these just keep getting longer and longer. Of course, this one has to be long because it is the most important. And honestly, it probably would have been much more epic to play as uh, Ignis in this section instead of just going back to Noctis and showing uh, Luna getting shanked by Arden. What are you going to do? Try to kill the Titan? Again? Swim to shore. Just a touch higher. You're too calm. They're here. Of course they're here. Tip. Um, I'm guessing that's because we're going to be swimming quite a bit. From time. Oh, Iggy. I thought you were a goner. It'll take more than a little single time. I'm more worried about knocked. I'll find a way to the altar, but I need you to keep the enemy distracted. I need a better vantage point. Ugh, they've got eyes everywhere. Uh, Ignis spell daggers can be a beautiful elemental properties. Uh, flame bind, uh, blades and beautiful fire type energy, st strong against single. Uh, fire, I mean, electricity spreads across, and frost damage does a lot of damage. Uh, uh, Easy. Yeah, that guy went down super fast, and if only Iggy was this powerful in the main game. But we, we, he's the main character now. Yeah, Frost. Let me do the thing. See, this just kind of goes on to the thing of like, why isn't this in the main game? Just so they could expand on this. Yep, I know. And this is like, seriously, he is just going insane. Jesus Christ, Iggy.
uh, hold to collect your thoughts and focus or dodge attacks and land counter strikes to fill the yellow meter. Then press uh, triangle again when the meter is full to gain total clarity, allowing you to target and land multiple attacks at once. When you gain total clarity, your spare daggers perform differently depending on their element. Flame is a single enemy multiple times, Frost is multiple enemies at once, and Storm, incredible damage to shocked enemies. Just keep coming. Uh, string together consecutive hits to increase your output. Okay. Jesus. There was a reason that he was asked to defend the Crown Prince. I see into my glasses. Huh, where do I go? Oh, here. Uh, press immediately after taking damage to steady yourself, then press O in time to deliver prompt Counter-Strike. Batman. Indistinct tinkering. You obtained a hookshot from a fallen magic deck to pull yourself to high ground. Oh my god. Use your hookshot to ascend buildings. Oh my god. We are Batman now? We are Batman now. I was joking, game! They aren't even doing anything in the Titans, just destroying them. Oh no, missiles. We broke his stinking arm and he grew it back. What do you think you're going to do? And plus, well, we played through the main game. We know nothing happens. Ow. Imperial forces have overtaken the city of Altissa. Press to check their presence in the situation on the map. Uh, press R1 to observe the state of Altissa from above. Uh, different colors show which, uh, which party controls a given area. Wipe out the Imperial forces in an area to return control to Accordio. Okay. Of course, we gotta get down there. Attention, all units. The has Check the Empire strength in given area from the fluctuating power balance graph in the upper left. Reclaim an area by wiping out all Imperial forces posted in that Imperial section. Forces moving from the city center toward the altar. All units withdraw from the front lines immediately. I repeat, all units withdraw immediately. Bye. Down. Oh! Take a spear. Wow. Iggy! So this one is more about taking damage and then delivering it back. before that happens. You could try crossing the eastern bridge, if it's still standing. Here's to hoping. I don't know now. Wish me luck. 
Okay, this area now belongs to the Accord. I can change view with R1. A lot of area is untaken. I actually kind of want to go back and see if I can take it back because this is probably how the multiple ending stuff and I'm not sure exactly uh, how everything works. Especially considering we're sneaking Batman now. Madam Secretary, come in. Never mind, those places are probably more important. Drop down. I need your help. I fear Knox is in danger. I'll dig the entire city of Artisha in case you haven't taken a look around. He and his girlfriend are probably long gone. No. I have promised to keep them safe. I promise I intend to keep them. Oh, no, I'll what? see yeah. what my men can do, but I won't promise anything. Why throw a thing if I can't do it? Do you copy? Take this place. It's over. Yeah. Bye bye. You missed. Also, I'm pretty sure I clicked the appropriate button. But this is a. I I wouldn't say. Mindless, but it's a very uh, kind of wonky uh, attack system, in my opinion. Not that many left, so obviously it's the ones that are that I left behind. Right? Uh, nope, over here. Down, Batterman. Ow. So used to Batman, why is it the trigger? Let's see. Obviously, that's the last one. Probably the best way to do it is uh, retake the places as they're taken. Ow. Down. You're mine. Where is even that sniper that was shooting me? Items as well. That's right. Yes, I know. There's a sniper up there, but I can't get to him. I thought I killed you, jerk. Dang it. Yeah, just do a normal attack. Dang it. There you go. Stinking pillars. There's still a lot of enemies to take care of in this area. And a lot of them are over here. Why do they even need Bannerman? It's like, we control this area. Thank you very much. Do not forget that you are subjugated under the Imperial Army. Also, this is going to show them for giving equal place to uh, these jerks. 
Ow. Also, I hate that it can linger on the screen, but if you click the button when it's still on the screen, it doesn't count. Just have it automatically disappear. Ooh, uh, there's a thing over here. If you're gonna be Batman, you have to be able to climb. I'm sorry. It's a, it's definitely a requirement. Just let me jump over it, dang it. <laughs> He's like, no, you, the thing that you should be able to climb over, you have to. Down with you. This is it. And I'm gone. Down, boy. Down with you with my instant kill. Oh boy, there's another one. So need missiles in my way. Ooh, not really what I wanted. It's over. Oh, that's an epic thing. Oh my! Seriously, if this is refined, this could be a game all its own. You're mine. And just imagine how much more tragic it would be if this was the gameplay that uh, he had this entire time. But, uh, and after he... Uh, after the damage that he sustains in uh, this chapter, I need to go rescue that one. Why? Because I'm getting that good ending, dang it. But yeah, just imagine how much more tragic it would be if we actually got connected to Ignis through his gameplay. And uh, then after the game itself, or uh, after this part itself, it actually makes us feel like, oh no, his epic gameplay. It just, it just feels like it could be a bit more. Yeah. Dang it. Attack. Moron. Jesus Christ, attack people. Total clarity, bye-bye. Seriously, because this is system, if it was refined, it would be pretty epic. It's over! Yeah, none of those have been taken over by Imperial. But I'm going to go ahead and search them over anyway, just because... Just because. I'm, I'm being tricked by nobody. You ain't going to go just like, oh, I got bad ending because those districts are not represented. And there are random... Uh, just random, random... Cannot view map from here. Ah, oh, come on. Oh, I guess it makes sense because he needs to be on a roof to actually tell. Let's see. All of these have been taken back. So it's just uh, these one, two, three, four, five. So all the way to the left, work our way around, yeah. All 
right? It's a bit more to the left where all that is. Uh, how do I get over there? There we go. Dang it. Batman, he is not. I guess these places need to be attacked to be reclaimed. Wait. What a terrible grappling hook. He's like, you can do this, you can't do that. Can't defeat the point of a grappling hook if you ask me. Yeah, so I'm guessing that this is, uh, this works on a... These places will be attacked when they're meant to. So, like, more than likely after we go get Noctis, these will be attacked. He's like, I keep doing the... Uh, like, trying to, uh... Predict stuff, but at the same time, it's just like, hey, you put districts there. You let me see the districts. It kind of makes me go like, I want to attack these districts or free these districts. And especially in a smaller game uh, mode like this, kind of makes me just want to be, just makes me want to do it, man. Hey, I saw a district thingy. That better not be one of the districts is being attacked. Go save it. More than likely, yeah, uh, it's just saying you entered this district. I don't really need to know. That is a really good sprinting thing. Like a sprinting animation. Gotta go. <laughs> oh, now this crumbles and we have to go around another way. Then again, we have a grappling hook. Why does this matter? Have you located the ring yet, Commander? And what of Luna Freya? Both, High Commander. But our forces are unable to extract either at present. We've no way of approaching the altar so long as the Archeon stands in our way. Gods above his side. Uh, neither the King nor the Oracle will escape with their lives if the fighting continues. Order a full retreat. I'm going in alone. But, sir... I assume you are already familiar with how I got this arm. Yes, sir. Then you must also know the ring is worthless without one who can wield it. Uh, very well, sir. Even though you keep sending these things out to kill him? You dress me with such impudence. Has he forgotten his place entirely? Well, I'm gonna kill you. Or is he too concerned about his sister to care? Do I steal his boat thingy? No. Maybe later. Time is of the essence. Which way to the altar? Well, attack already, dumbass. Your mind. Yeah. He just stood there, fixing his hair. Took a single bullet. Nope. Seriously, this could be like an entire superhero concept though. That's the same time kind of flash. Just spam this. Yeah, this one has fallen. Aha. Uh -huh. Wow. You just keep coming. Oh boy, insta death thingy. I remember you. Yeah. 
no attack the stinking god damn it this one total clarity this one and now bye now Oh boy, more! I love the big guns, eh? Too bad the big guns go down in one hit in a pre-animated uh, takedown maneuver. Just sit on the spear, why don't you? Bye. <laughs> Wipe out the Imperial fleet. This is it! There's always more. Ow. Hello, asshole. I went down. Let me Phoenix down myself. Hello. What the hell? No, you must suffer. You must suffer. Let me do something. It's like he has the thing where it's just like, I'm so used to the other ones being like, oh, this. Like, I'm just so used to the other ones being just like, oh, you went down. It's like, I'm so used to that. So yeah, my bad, but at the same time, there's so many different ways of doing it. Lock on. I keep thinking that it's a different box because I'm so used to Batman. Just so used to Batman. Bye. This is it. Seriously, we could just send send in uh, Ignis. Uh, Attention, all units. Assemble at the docks and prepare for withdrawal immediately. We depart in three minutes. Wait, I'm headed to the altar. I need a boat. Have you lost your marbles? No, but we'll lose the king if we don't act. Get him what he wants. Understood. Understood.